They have raised thousands of dollars for fellow first responders. But when some Dallas police officers hit the ice for a charity hockey game this weekend, they'll play with a special purpose. JD Miles live at the Star Center in Farmers Branch with the story you'll only see here. JD. Gilma, this weekend's game between a Dallas police hockey team and a team of pros was supposed to be just another fundraiser for sick and injured first responders or the families of those killed. But a sad twist of fate will now have them playing on Saturday for one of their own teammates. Brian Simons found a way to combine his police work with his passion when the 33-year-old Dallas police sergeant helped organize an emotional charity hockey game not long after the horrific sniper attack in 2016 that killed five law enforcement officers. It's led to several more fundraising games in the years since. Over the recent holidays, Simons, a husband of, and father of six, including two 15-month-old twins, was diagnosed with cancer that he learned had spread. When Simons' fellow teammates learned about his condition, they decided to play this weekend solely for him. Ticket sales from the upcoming game will benefit medical expenses from the officer's cancer battle. As much as you know the depression, anxiety, and you know helplessness that comes with this, uh, you know the the people that are around me right now. I mean, it's it makes me feel like that I can do it. It gives me more strength, you know, going forward. Simons won't be able to play this Saturday, but he's hoping to hit the ice again later this year when he recovers. Live in Farmers Branch, JD Miles, CBS 11 News.